Like I've been mentioning, it's gotten so cold, and typically I'm on here asking for that warm weather to come back, and it seems like it might be gone for Careful. now at least. Careful what you ask for. Uh, we're going to be on a roller coaster for the next few days. We have a little weather for everyone. Some cold weather, some warm to almost hot weather, and then okay. more cold weather comes back. So let's take a look at our weather headlines for the uh, upcoming week and uh, beyond. Uh, chilly nights, warm days through the weekend. We're in the lower 40s right now, but we'll be in the middle 80s by tomorrow afternoon. No rain in the forecast anytime soon. We haven't had any rain since 13 days ago when Helene hit the area and we're not going to have rain for at least the next seven days or so. And then the coolest air of the season comes in here and it's mighty chilly out there right now. It'll be even cooler toward the middle part of the upcoming week. Here's your long care forecast for Saturday starting off a little bit on the cool side at 10 o'clock. 57 degrees will be rebounded up to 76 as we head toward 2 o'clock. It will be a nice fall day at the lake. A light wind today from the west at 1 to 5. Lake level uh, just below the full pool uh, there at about 330 feet for the latest elevation and uh, the water temperature at 74. These cool morning temperatures are the main thing you're going to notice when you head out the door this morning. Current temperature all the way down in Sylvania at 40 degrees. We're 43 in Augusta, 44 in Evans and waking up to 46 this morning in Aiken. First alert radar network is dry and it's going to stay dry. Like I said, for the foreseeable future, we'll be turning to the north for this cold front to eventually come through the area. Uh, during the day on Monday. The air mass is so dry, we're not going to have any rain with that front, but it does have a lot of cool air behind it. Uh, this is our upper level forecast, our jet stream forecast, if you will. It is proportionate to uh, color, uh, temperature. The colors are, I should say, and that uh, big bubble of blue you see there will be rushing down from the Arctic Circle, and uh, we get a dose of some chilly weather by Wednesday and Thursday morning. We'll be talking about low temperatures down into the 30s in many locations. Hour by hour as we head through the day today and through the day tomorrow, we are going to be talking about perfect sunshine, literally not a cloud in the sky today, tomorrow, probably not even Monday either. And then uh, dry skies continue uh, for the upcoming work week. So enjoy a nice fall day today. The high temperature in Barnwell around 79. Same thing for you in Thompson. Tonight it will be chilly for October once again. Clear skies, calm winds will take us down to 44 in Gibson. For the week ahead, absolutely no rain in the forecast. A couple of warm afternoons Sunday and Monday with highs all the way into the middle 80s. We'll drop it into the lower 70s for a high Tuesday, 60s for high temperatures Wednesday and Thursday. If we were to hit that 36 on Thursday morning, there more than likely would be some frost around the area.